It's time for July's market report. Has last month's surge continued? Find out here. I was very pleased to report last month how buoyant the market was following a state agent's release from lockdown. Sounds like we were in prison, doesn't it? So let's see how July compared. There were 47 instructions on the market in the M44 area in July, compared to the year before there were, where there was 42. So it's slightly better, but no massive difference like we saw in June. Last month sales, there were 43 in the M44 area. In 2019, there were 39. So a difference of four. So again, slight improvement, but with many people delaying selling or buying and also not going on holiday due to the Corona outbreak, that is not surprising that it's a little bit higher than last year. The government's announcement about stamp duty being stopped until the end of March has brought more sellers out looking for more expensive houses. But as most houses in this area fall under the threshold, it's only affecting the top of the chains. There were 23 reduced properties last month, which again is high, so still people trying the market but not getting anywhere. When picking an agent, the two most important things you ask are their average sales times and average prices achieved. The national average in the UK is usually around 96% of asking price, so that's a good basis to uh, look upon. The stats for the M44 are the following. As you can see, the quickest selling agent in the area is currently Oliver James, with an average of 12 weeks, with agent B at 14 weeks, just behind, and agent C uh, at 34 weeks, which just shows you the massive difference between Oliver James and agent C. Highest prices achieved in the area, as of today, are as follows. Oliver James are currently achieving the highest prices in the area with 99.2% of asking prices achieved, Agent B at 96.6% and Agent C just 95.4%. This is a massive difference. To give you an example with these average prices on a £200,000 house, on average Oliver James would achieve £198,400 for your house, Agent B would achieve 193,200 and Agent C would achieve 190,800. As you can see, this makes a massive difference and can make over 7,000 pound difference by picking the wrong agent just on a 200,000 pound house. Of the sales made in July, here is the breakdown of which property type sold. As you can see, semi-detached are the most popular with 28 sold with just one bungalow selling. As always, I'm here for any property advice. Stay safe, keep well, and I'll see you again next month.